here's my summer 16 skincare routine featuring vanity planets spin for perfect skin the products i use are burt's bees soap bark and chamomile deep cleansing cream now solutions almond oil now solutions rose hip seed oil shea butter in the summertime yes you'll see why and of course my vanity planet spin for perfect skin brush so I start off with a dirty, smelly, nasty face. It's okay, quiche. And I use several drops of almond oil and massage it into my face. This really helps to break up and loosen dirt, grease, makeup, etc. so that it can wash off easily. Plus, it leaves your face moisturized so the soap you wash with doesn't dry your face out. Also, make sure to pay special attention to the eye area because one, it's very delicate and two, Almond oil is great for reducing fine lines and dark circles. Now it's time to get a deep clean and exfoliate. This face wash, face wash, Keisha? <laughs> this face wash leaves your face feeling very cool, which is perfect for the summer. Now I gotta wet my face and start brushing. The Spin for Perfect Skin Brush has been my go-to all year long, but it's especially great this summer since I get more oil and sweat buildup in the heat. This is able to give me a really deep clean and reveal a fresh new layer of soft and healthy skin. Remember to exfoliate your lips too for better lipstick application, I'm just saying. You can get your Spin for Perfect Skin brush for 70% off with the code Keisha Spin. I'll have the link below, okay? Yeah. So after I rinse it off, I towel dry, pat, pat, pat. And my face is already moisturized from the almond oil, so I could stop here, but I want to use my miracle oil, as I like to call it, my rosehip seed oil. This is great for lightening dark spots that the summer sun can exaggerate. It's very lightweight, much like the almond oil. Actually, I think it's even lighter than the almond oil. Now, shea butter. I wouldn't use it on the days I use the almond oil and the rosehip seed oil. I'd only use it on its own. But did you know that shea butter has properties that fight against harmful UV rays? Yeah, it's an all natural alternative to sunblock. Keep in mind that a little goes a long way, so you'll only need to use a little scratch to get the job done. If you use the right amount, you won't get that grease face. And I almost forgot, on occasion, I like to mist my face with cold rose water. So this is my summer 16 skincare routine. Thanks Vanity Planner for sponsoring this video. Remember to get your spin for perfect skin, 70% off with the coupon code Keisha Spin. Thanks for watching. Love, light, and locks.